Today I'm going to show you that it is actually possible to shoot mortars significantly further than 700 meters. So PUBG, in keeping with its trend of realism, actually takes the height of the mortar itself relative to the shell's landing spot into account. This means that if you shoot the mortar from a mountain or a tall spot, you'll actually be able to shoot incredibly far. So with the ability to shoot further than 700 meters comes the question, can you consistently tell how far you will shoot from a given point? Theoretically it is possible to calculate your exact hittable distance from a mountain, but there's some significant assumptions and problems. Boom! 2 plus 2 is 4, minus 1, that's 3, quick maths! The initial mortar speed and shot angle are unknown. You can measure the height of the mountain you're on above the height of your target, roughly by using a spotter scope, scouting how far away the top of the mountain is from where you're standing, and then using the mini-map to calculate your distance from your target. With that, you can calculate the height using the Pythagorean theorem. We can assume the mortar's shot angle is 45 degrees because that's the ideal angle for long-range projectiles. Using this assumed launch angle and our other facts from our earlier video of the shot, we can try to determine the range. We know the time of flight, Solving for initial velocity using time of flight, we get a velocity of 14.4 meters a second. If we sanity check that by then plugging it into the equation for range of projectile, because we know the projectile flew 846 meters, we get nonsense results of 4730 meters. So this highlights my point. There are too many unknowns, and our methods for measuring the height of the mountain are too imprecise for me to say with any level of confidence that we can consistently calculate the exact range of this. So, all that being said, I recommend using a spotter scope or a 8x or 15x to be able to accurately range the mortar. This is kind of a fun little trick, pretty complicated to set up because you have to get up on top of a high spice with a mortar. So, easiest way is glider or emergency pickup and then land on the high space and use the mortar from there, but I'm excited to see if anybody can produce a world record mortar distance shot from this. So I said 846 meters is the farthest I've managed to get so far, but it is theoretically possible to go further if you can find a bigger height differential. I think Everest Mountain on Erangel is a good candidate. Anyway, if you have any questions or comments, put them down below. Thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you on the next one.